In this particular example, I've gone to the calendar section of a course in order to review how I should set up a due date uh, for an assignment in my course. You'll notice that um, in Canvas, in the month view, uh, right now I'm in, uh, today is Sunday, August 30th. Tomorrow, all of my students across all of my sections are going to meet on Monday, August 31st. The first assignment that they're going to be asked to complete, uh, to start in class and complete uh, that very evening is going to be one on founding ideals and classroom expectations. You'll notice that I'm expecting students from across all five of my sections of my class to complete this assignment by Tuesday the 1st. So the due date for any particular assignment should always be set to the date that you expect for students to either turn in the uh, assignment in class uh, to you or online through Canvas or another, um, uh, another digital tool. So again, the due date translates to the date that you are expecting a submission. In the second example, you'll, you'll notice that um, I've already uh, published a, uh, an assignment about reading review uh, in Chapter 26 of the textbook. Uh, students are going to have two weeks to complete this reading, but by, chap uh, by September 11th, I'm expecting that Chapter 26 is completed across all the sections. Again, the due date is the date that you're expecting students to have completed the work and turned in that work to you.